Well, want to know more. You're going to be a two-time MVP, seven-time All-Star, and you break your nose like a dozen times. Come on, Steve. Okay, okay. How about this? Ten years from now, you visit my school and it'll help turn my life around. Still don't think I'm from the future, huh? We're gonna love that shot in Phoenix. The idea was simple. What would you say if you had the chance to meet the players when they were younger? Through the NBA, as well as the players' friends and family, we were able to get five great clips of Durant, CP, Nash, Amari, and Steph Curry. The key to making these commercials believable was finding ways for the characters from the future to interact with the footage from the players' past. This meant we had to edit, script, and choreograph the spots prior to shooting to find ways for these interactions to happen naturally. After this, we recreated the scenes against blue screen. Stand-ins mimic the player's action in order for the actors to know where to look and how to react. But then the real work began, special effects. First, we removed unnecessary elements, such as the coach from the Nash bot from the player's footage. Then the footage we shot was stabilized and tracked with the camera move from the archival footage. This allowed us to retain the handheld camera look from the original footage. Next, we moved Nash backwards in order to get the eye line between him and the character from the future to connect and therefore be more meaningful. Finally, we cloned textures from the archival footage into our footage and matched color and texture. In the end, we had a conversation that looked as though it had really happened. Still don't think I'm from the future, huh? We're gonna love that shot in Phoenix. So that's mm, how technology. they do it. It's Pretty very sweet. Nice. Pretty yeah. sweet. I'd like to talk to my young self for about 15 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, you'll be at NBA TV.